हॅलो डिअर स्टुडंट्स आय एम अजय करमरकर बिफोर प्रोसिडिंग फर्दर आय सजेस्ट यू वन थिंग प्लीज वॉच व्हिडिओ कम्प्लिटली सीट विथ कॉपी पेन इफ यू फाइंड सम वेअर इम्पॉर्टंट देन नोट इट अँड प्रोसिडिंग फर्दर इफ यू फाइंड सम डिफिकल्टीज देन प्लीज राईट इन कमेंट बॉक्स आय विल डेफिनेटली सॉल्व युअर प्रॉब्लेम अँड अलॉंग विथ प्लीज लाईक शेअर अँड सबस्क्राईब माय चॅनल दॅट कॅन रीच मोर अँड मोर स्टुडंट्स थँक यू Let's move on what the question says a small roller of diameter 20 cm has an axle of diameter 20 cm it is on a horizontal floor and a meter scale is positioned horizontally on its axle with one edge of the scale on top of the axle the scale is now pushed slowly on the axle so that it moves without slipping on the axle and the roller starts rolling without slipping after the roller has moved 50 cm the position of the scale will look like and uh, you have given four options when this scale moved it shows the middle point this point will be 50 cm this point is 75 25 and 100 cm okay now you can understand this question by seeing this experiment i have some figure some object like that figure and uh, a scale is placed just upside to the axle as well as we have to move 50 cm forward then find out this mark and what is the reading actually okay i hope so you understand this experiment now we have come to the question This question is based on the concept of angular velocity. You can see that here axle fixed this roller and as well as it will be moved it means same angular velocity. So here it is a uh, you can see that upper view of this given object it is inner radius is 10 cm outer radius is uh, 20 cm and suppose to be it will be move 50 cm forward then it means angles in both the condition angles inner angle and outer angle same because angular velocity is same they subtain equal angle so therefore angular velocity same angular velocity is equal to theta by t so therefore angular velocity is directly proportional to the theta and what is theta theta equal to arc upon radius then theta 1 equal to theta 2 because the same angle here the theta and this theta same but arc and radius is different so they are in equal proportion x1 upon r1 equal to x2 upon r2 x1 to be find out r1 is given 10 cm x2 what is x2 actually this x2 means 50 cm move forward it means its arc is 50 cm so therefore it is 50 and r2 is 20 cm then this cancel out and x1 is 25 cm then what does it mean of 25 cm here you can see that x equal to 0 and this mark is 100 cm because we have given meter scale meter scale means 0 to 100 so therefore it will be move 25 cm forward then 25 meter 25 cm forward it means this mark shows 75 cm so here our b option is correct i hope so you understand this question thank you Thank you for staying till the ends of this video and yes let me remind you again don't forget to subscribe this channel that can you get the information for the next video bye bye take care